From the Daniel Lynch Gymnasium in Brooklyn Heights, it's St. Francis of Brooklyn College Terriers basketball. As today, the Terriers take on the Highlanders from the New Jersey Institute of Technology. Pass, back door. This is Evans moving around the screen by Chellin. Now Kurtinich. And Stevano reset with seven to shoot. Three pointer. Good from Kurtinich. Stevan had a season high 14 points against Medgar Evers. And the freshman from Monmouth County, New Jersey, has established himself as the top reserve on this team. Another three try for Kurtinich, and Stevan knocks it down again. He's got two trifectas, and the Terriers are back on top. Here comes Gibbs for NJIT. Zach Cooks got poked in the eye by Chauncey Hawkins. No call. Cooks confidently knocks down the tray. Former champion boxer, king of the Golden Gloves. Remember him? Well, the Terriers are going to get have, uh, some more weak side help on their defense. Robbie Higgins hits from downtown Brooklyn. His first points of the day. Tied for game high with eight. And a steal from Higgins. He took it right away from Williams. Robbie drives in, high off the window, and it goes. Higgins, 10 points. Yaya gives to Unique. Hawkins, Chauncey into the trees. Little finger roll goes for Hawkins. He's got four, and the Terriers lead by three. Good drive, nice job of attacking by Chauncey on that play. Gibbs, guarded by Higgins with 12 to shoot. Gibbs, Diakite Gibbs, five seconds on the shot clock. Gibbs drives in, puts up a lefty floater. It's rebounded and put back by Diakite, and NJIT regains the lead. Suleiman Diakite with his first two points of the day. That five-point cushion was their biggest so far today. Here's Higgins with a shake and bake, and he goes to the rack again. Robbie Higgins, a new career high, and we're still in the first half. He's got 14. And I'll tell you, Glenn Breich is probably very happy not to see Zach Cooks go to the ball. Backdoor pass was intended for Cooks. Got through. Here's Zach from three. And he rattles it home. Cooks with his third triple of the game. He's got 11. Want to make a stance defensively and not trade baskets. Hawkins. Shot altered by Mayo. And Xavier comes away with a rebound, then throws it away. Kurtinich the steal. Hawkins puts it up. And he's fouled, it counts. Chauncey will go to the line. Gibbs working left, pulls up, and we're tied again as Gibbs now has nine on the day. It's been a very back and forth contest today. Biggest lead for the Terriers was six. Three-pointer, Mr. McLean, his second from downtown, 7.25 to play. McLean from three, off the rim, no good. Shetland knocks it back out to Hawkins, and the Terriers can reset. Well, Higgins' bench point so far has been the story of this game. Kurtinich, Stevan, another three, is third of the game. Gibbs guarded by Hawkins. Keep an eye on Cooks, who's got Higgins. There's a two for Gibbs. He's been hot in the second half. Next foul against the Highlanders will put the Terriers in a double bonus situation. Kurtinich trying to draw it on Walsh. 15 to shoot for Hawkins, down low Chellin. Nice spin move, and Dennis hits the reverse layup to put the Terriers back on top. Excellent move right there, and again, he does a good job of just waiting things out and reading the defense. This one clinches a tie. No good. Willis rebounds. Six seconds left. Two to tie, three to win. Gibbs to the hole. No good. Put back. No good. And the Terriers hang on as McLean grabs the final rebound. Well, the Highlanders had two chances. Gibbs the initial layup and then a putback for NJIT. Neither shot goes and the Terriers survive. Another nail biter. 
their second straight.